And now, another edition of Mob TV Hits. In Mob, we crust. There's nothing more Italian than a slice of New York pizza pie. And there's nothing more mobster than using a pizza place as a front for illegal activity. In 1959, a low-level hoodlum from New York's Little Italy, named Ralph, Raphael, Rafi, or Ray for short Cuomo, was released from prison after serving a stretch for armed robbery. Looking for a fresh start, Cuomo opened a pizzeria on Prince Street, calling it Ray's Pizza, which, according to him, sounded better than Ralph's Pizza. Surprisingly, the pizza was really good. Ray's drew lines out the door, becoming a New York institution, which wasn't exactly the best way to hide the fact that his real business wasn't pizza. The restaurant was, in fact, the home base for a drug ring run by the Lucchese crime family. You see, in the basement, right below the pizza ovens, the Lucchese's laundered cash and bundled heroin. But as his pizza grew in popularity, Rafi was torn between the two worlds. Despite branching out and adding more locations, he continued to make his real money from a different kind of cheese. And while the cops bugged his pizzeria on multiple occasions, they never could catch him in the act. After he died, Ralph's heirs sold the Prince Street tenement. The building was almost as lucrative as the drugs, netting 5.9 million bucks. Over the years, there have been multiple imitators, but the legend of Ray's Pizza lives on. Till this day, no one has divulged what made Ray's secret sauce so addicting. This has been another edition of Mob TV Hits.